hoffentlich verreckt er sich den Kopf nicht. I will drive to a person. Jetzt wird's schwer. Viele Personen im Publikum, eine von Plakate Person im Vordergrund. I will now try to recognize you. Please look towards my camera. Sorry, I do not know you. Das ist richtig. I will drive to a person. I will now try to recognize you. Please look towards my camera. I know you. You are Thomas. You ordered ketchup. Das ist richtig. I will continue searching for people. Objects to clean up. 
So now we make a 3D laser scan, so we perceive the whole environment in 3D, so that we yeah, find out where the objects are standing, and we can also have a model of the 3D environment in meshes, and so we can plan how to stack the cups or how to grasp an object collision-free. So we do not collide with any obstacles here or with other objects. So now the scan is finished and now it calculates where the object is standing. I have found three objects. Cup, potato sticks, cup. I plan to stack the cup into the cup. I so plan the path to grasp the cup. Okay, I found a path. So it now goes for the first cup and grasps it. So hopefully our triple will work. We have some hardware problems with it. So sometimes if you send the command, the triple doesn't open or doesn't close properly, or we get some wrong values, but right now it looks very promising. Yeah, so it's closed, but it, it's in the tripper. I plan the path how to stack the objects. So now it tries to put one cup in the other cup, because it's, it's known that you can stack those cups. It's in the knowledge base. And we use a higher level planner to, to plan how to stack cups or how to, to deal with the objects on the, okay, on the table. Okay, I found a path. So you see it lifts it above the potato stick, so you see really here it's collision free. So it's now in the other cup. And now it grabs both cups and goes to throw them in the kitchen sink. I yep. grasp the cup and throw it into the kitchen sink. I plan the path to grasp the cup. Okay, I found a path. So we check if if we have the object, so we know the encoder values, and we know if uh, the, the gripper is closed, we know that there is a encoder value, and so it can check if there is really a cup in the, the gripper. And if we detect that the cup slipped out of the gripper, we do some error handling, of course. So we, we model all those possibilities, and we all I am heading for the kitchen them. to throw the objects into the kitchen sink. Now it looks better. I, I have reached like the kitchen. Now I plan how to throw the objects so into the sink. Stuck, stuck there. So now it, it's at, at the kitchen sink and now it throws it into the kitchen sink. Yeah. Hmm. And now the robot knows that there's another object on the table, so it goes back to the table and wants to clean up the other object. So it's going back to the table and cleaning up the other object. Uh. I have reached the table and will scan for objects to clean up. I have found one object. Okay. Potato sticks. I grasp the potato sticks and throw it into the trash bin. I plan the path to grasp the potato sticks. 30%. Okay, I found a path. Okay, she's, she's still able to, to grasp the potato sticks. Ten minutes. End of them. Okay. So now for questions, we can let the robot run there. Let's throw it into the trash bin.